$89 per month. Plus, with our $500 best price guarantee, if we can't beat your best price, we'll give you $500. Cardinus, BMW, Loop 499, Harlingen. The San Isidro girls basketball team dealing with a big loss before their season started. Their head coach passed away in August. As Channel 5's Ruben Juarez explains, his legacy lives on. Benny Alvarado influenced hundreds of kids at San Isidro in the classroom and the basketball court. Two of the people closest to him are coaching the girls team in his honor. Harry, get back, get back. San Isidro boys basketball coach Rolando Garza is in the midst of his most emotional season in 27 years as a head coach. Well, it's difficult when you lose like you know, your best friend, you know, so we, we've been working together for a while. Let's go defense, ladies. Garza and former San Isidro girls coach Benny Alvarado grew up together in the small Star County town. Practically did, you know, did everything together and we grew up together in the same school district. We, from pre-K, we graduated here in 1978 and uh, we stayed, we, we remained close all the way through. Alvarado died of a heart attack in August. No one was sure who would coach the girls team. Again, there you go. Garza stepped in. I talked to my wife about it and I, I, I think I said, I think I owe him, I owe him this. Alvarado's love for basketball rubbed off on his son, Aaron. When I was in the first grade, I started traveling with him as his manager, and in third grade, I became his statistician, so I kind of traveled with him all throughout. Aaron followed his dad's footsteps and became a coach. He got hired at San Isidro last summer. This is going to be the two of us living out a dream, and all of a sudden, that uh, reality is gone, and happened a few days before my first day of work and coming in that first week was one of the toughest things I had to do. It's also been tough for the girls on the team who coach Benny cared for as if they were his own children. Coach Benny would always say we got our foot in the door and now we're going to kick it down being that we got second place last year. So this year we wanted to kick the door down. Hopefully we still can. Come on, come on, let's go, let's go. The Tigers are currently in second place in District 32 2A with a 3 and 1 record. The Tigers leave a spot open on their bench with the shirt Coach Benny wore for games draped over his seat. Reporting in the studio, Ruben Juarez, Channel 5 Sports.